Statistics at the Ministry of Health show that six mothers die daily due to birth-related complications. The director in charge of clinical services at the Ministry of Health, Dr. Charles Olaro, says 36% of mothers still deliver at home, an issue that contributes to maternal mortality. In trying to encourage mothers to deliver from health facilities, Ministry of Health initiated a four-year reproductive health voucher project in 2015 to support poor mothers in rural areas during pregnancy and delivery. My daddy recognized that I was pregnant, could not take care of me again. And I fell sick. I fell sick the first time before them knowing that I was pregnant. They took me to that very hospital. They treated me. We came back. Now the second time, after me getting the voucher, I was taken to the hospital. I went my, by myself to the hospital for Antinento, but I was feeling some sick. This reproductive health voucher project is implemented by Maristops Uganda on behalf of the Minister of Health, where vulnerable expectant mothers are supported to access maternal health services in both public and private health facilities. We have vouchers as Maristops, which we distribute to the poor women in the rural areas using the VHT network, the village health team members. The village health team members are the ones who are able to walk down and identify the pregnant women and be able to give this voucher at 4,000 shillings. Then the woman is directed to the facilities which are contracted to go and get a service. So when they reach there, they, uh, they present their voucher and then the health facility provides the service. The woman is not supposed to pay any more money if she has a voucher. According to the Ministry of Health, the voucher project aims at achieving sustainable development goal one of meeting the health needs of the poor. To, so that we would want that all mothers who need to deliver, deliver from the health facility. We have also seen an in increase in the mothers delivering from the health facility from 54 in 2011 to 70. But now if you look at the other 30 percent, this is still a very big, big number. And when there are complications, then definitely you lose a mother. So the quite currently the commonest causes of deaths of mothers in this country, almost 40 percent is because of obstetric hemorrhage or bleeding after childbirth or bleeding before, or the bleeding can start even before you have gone to one, you have gone to labor. The reproductive health voucher project targets to reach over 150,000 women in 25 districts of southwestern and eastern Uganda by December this year. Adia Nakuti. UBC.